All right, you guys, we're here in Laredo. I'm a little frustrated right now, so didn't try to record it. This guy really sucks at what he's doing. It's pissing me off, so just trying to hurry up and get this done with. Uh, this load's just stupid. I don't understand it. So I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put six here. And same thing there, I'm gonna probably put six. This guy has a trainer. He still almost took out. Uh, this load's going to Springfield. So our plan is I'm trying to get out of here and he's taking forever. Plan was to uh, go down the road 48 miles but way traffic and everything and he's taking forever this doesn't look like it's gonna happen even this just these boards standing up it's not gonna work it's like fuck Can you use a different board? Thank you. Now. You're gonna put it there? Huh? Yeah. Because if it's just that one, I'm gonna need. Okay, I'm gonna need throw straps first. Five on there. I'm gonna get two more.
so slow. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Fuck. I want to get the hell out of here. this place Five here. Uh, got two, three, five there. So five and five, and then three up on top. It's 13 straps. I know it looks kind of ugly. I'm just not in the mood. What I might do is throw more strap when we're going that way when I get to shut down for the night. Did you get my weight on the prime driver on this scale? Seventy-seven six eighty. Seventy-seven six eighty. You're good, sir. Ten four. Thank you. Load already. Your pictures. Uh, yes. Okay, you're good. Just go ahead and pull to the side and give us about five ten minutes for paperwork. Ten four. 
What's up you guys? We're here in Stringtown, Oklahoma. Loads riding nice, not too bad. Uh, the only issue I had, and I thought it shifted, was this right here. I thought this was walking. But uh, I went back on my GoPro, because I did a video, and it, it looks just like this. So none of these really did walk, but I thought I freaked out a little bit until I saw the video. So those are actually not moving. They're doing pretty good. So not too little worries, but. What's up everyone? We're here in Springfield, Missouri. Uh, just been going through a lot of rain. There was some hail. So, probably I'm gonna have to get the rain gear on. Uh, it's sprinkling right now, so I'm not worried, but if it can stay like this, I won't. Um, so I did do a really good video on this, and I know that. Uh, I was really frustrated with this load. The guy took like an hour and a half to load. And then on top of that, he uh, put the wrong stuff, as you can see in the video. Uh, it's supposed to be non-painted, so. Really frustrated. So I didn't make the greatest video, so it is what it is. Uh, the notes on here, you can see, it's gonna say, uh, if you come here before seven, uh, turn in here, or before eight. So we're gonna do that. It's a little dark back here, but let's make sure we swing wide. Their yard is back here. Uh, the load did really pretty. The load did pretty good. Uh, no issues. Uh, what is their yard? That's why I have Google Maps. You see, if you have this on ready, and then you have your Prime mobile app on the side, you can read, and then you can see. Uh, all right, let's get back here. The gate's open. How far back he wants me to go. What I'm gonna do is get up here enough to where I can see in the office. Oh, there's a wheeler meadows. I'm gonna go down here. I'm gonna park right here in the front. It's a little good spot right here. Right in the middle. You always try to get right in the middle for now until they tell you so they can get on both sides. So I always start right there. All right, I'm gonna go check in right here. See the gate I think is closed. That's why they say uh if you come here before eight that gate's closed. So the directions were correct. Oh, there you are. <laughs> I got a delivery for eight o'clock. There you, you go. Come in this back yeah, I read the direction, so. Out in the middle, out here. Yeah, right in the middle, right in front of that. What's up, everyone? We're here in Flippin, Arkansas. I got my dream load, another dream load, yes. We're getting boats and it's going to Anaheim. So excited to go home for the weekend. Got my boat load, so I'm pretty excited. Uh, the way they do it out here is they load it, they secure it, 
most people I've talked to, they say usually do one or two more clicks on the winch. So it's an easy load and it's something different, pretty cool. So I like different things and doing something different. So they're on lunch. I'm eating too, just waiting for them, but hopefully we can get loaded pretty quick uh, so I can make it home. It's gonna be very tight. It's about 1,600 miles from here to Anaheim. And it's Thursday and I've already driven like half my clock already today. So uh, the goal is try to get 300 miles. Then I'll leave me 1,300. We can average 650. So if I can knock out 300 miles and then run 650 miles Friday and Saturday, I can get home for a 34. So that's gonna be the plan. Uh, they're getting back from lunch right now. So I'm waiting for them to pull me in. It will get loaded and I'll do a video on that. So we'll see you on the next video. Just are here at the Fontana yard on a Saturday. This is what the boat looks like. Good condition. What's up everyone? Um, we are unloaded. I put all my stuff away. Uh, I put my D part in right as they took the first boat off. Um, it's been an hour and a half. My dispatcher said, doesn't look like there's any loads. Uh, a lot of businesses are closed because of Martin Luther King Day. So I'm gonna head back to the yard, go home. I just wish I knew that most businesses were closed to pick up because I would just stayed home, never came out until Tuesday. But it is what it is. Um, just enjoy more time off. So that's what we're gonna do. Um, I didn't do a video of the loading for the boats because they had a lot of private stuff in there. So they didn't want me to film, which is understandable. Uh, if places ask not to film, I don't film. Uh, but it'd been pretty cool if you guys would have saw uh, they had like eight people uh, put the boats on the trailer and then uh, strap it down. So I didn't really have to do anything. Uh, just winch it down a little tighter when I rolled out just to double check it. But the guy said you can crank down as hard as you can. And I got a bunch of two inch straps and two inch ratchets. So all in all, it was a great load. I like those kind of loads fast, no work and you get paid. So. Um, so I'm gonna head to the house. I'll see you guys on the next video. Appreciate every single one of you guys subscribing, liking, commenting, doing all those things. Uh, appreciate, every, appreciate every single one of y'all. So I'll see you guys on the next video. Stay safe. Peace out.